Homemade Bed Bug Repellent As the name implies, bed bugs are tiny, brownish insects that set up residence in your bed and other bedroom areas. The years after World War II saw a drastic decline in these intrusive insects, but in recent years, their numbers have been increasing. Regular control methods involve chemicals administered by a pest control company, but if you do not have a severe infestation or want to deter future insects, create a homemade bed bug repellent using natural resources. Things you'll need Mint leaves Pot with water Strainer Spray bottles too Crushed garlic cloves Cayenne powder Dried thyme Rosemary Eucalyptus clove Bay leaves Sachet bags as many as you want Place mint leaves in a pot filled with water, and boil them Strain the boiled solution into a spray bottle, and spray your mattress and bed sheets with it. Mint acts as a bed bug repellent because the odor is repugnant to these insects, which keeps them away. Crush a few garlic cloves, boil them and strain the solution into another spray bottle. Spray bedroom areas, such as baseboards and bed frames, where you see bed bugs. As with mint, the garlic aroma drives these pests away. Sprinkle cayenne powder in your bed frame as well as other locations, such as cracks and crevices in walls, where you find the bed bugs. The cayenne is an irritant to bed bugs. Crush dried thyme, rosemary, eucalyptus, clove and bay leaves, and mix the herbs together. Place the herbs in sachets, and leave them underneath your mattress and in traveling gear, such as suitcases or backpacks, where bed bugs can travel with you. Tips Warnings Refrain from bringing home discarded mattresses or other furniture as these items have the potential to carry bed bugs or their unhatched eggs. Wash your bedding and clothes in hot water to kill of any potential bugs. Further, seal in cracks along baseboards and walls to seal off attractive nesting sites. If a severe infestation occurs, Seek help from a pest control company that has the tools and resources to find the bugs and get rid of them.